Gun violence, of course, also plaguing schools across the country. Earlier this year, 21 people, mostly kids, were killed in that mass shooting in Uvalde, Texas. And now safety is top of mind as kids get ready to fill classrooms here in the Hudson Valley. News 12's Diane Caruso shows us what's being done to try and protect students. Oh boy. I'll kill everyone. This I'll is an kill active everyone. shooter drill. I'll kill a necessary yeah, evil yeah, law yeah. enforcement agencies take part in every year. The town of Clarkstown and the town of Orangetown, the town boards fully support the police departments in getting this training done. There is nothing more important than safeguarding the lives of our children. News 12 was invited along this summer as Clarkstown and Orangetown officers trained side by side at Nyack High School, which falls between both their jurisdictions. We train this, we take it seriously. And something Thomas Ronan, commander of Clarkstown Police's critical incident response team, says requires teamwork. If an event like this should happen, we will be responding at the same time, and we like to know each other and make sure that our techniques and tactics are similar. From the response, 226 is on scene, we'll have to an arrest. Contact right, contact right. While they use fake rounds and actors, they're preparing for a real situation. Since Clarkstown began active shooter training after Columbine in 1999, there have been some changes. 26 to 1. Like rather than wait for backup, the first officer on the scene is expected to go in with the mindset, stop the killing, then stop the dying. They've learned new ways to take down doors, and treat the injured. Also, Clarkstown police now have nine members who serve as school resource officers at these various schools. And it's not just Nyack. Other schools across the Hudson Valley are stepping up their security. North Rockland just bought these vehicles, known as Gators, and hired a security team to patrol outside each school. A decision made following the shooting in Uvalde, Texas, earlier this year. And our kids today, they can't meet their learning goals, they can't reach their potential if they don't feel safe in school, and if their parents don't feel safe in school. So it, it has been a priority of, of us at, here at North Rockland to address those concerns. Rice City School District is adding another layer of protection to all five of their schools with this locked-in security vestibule area. Poughkeepsie has installed this new scanner at the high school entrance, which would alert security if there's a potential weapon. Efforts to make sure safety is always in session this school year. Diane Crusoe, News 12.